Hey everyone, welcome back to Sebrov. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix kernel ARNL VPN error that comes while installing the kernel script runner on your Windows 10 or Windows 11. So I will be sharing the best way to fix this problem. So make sure that you watch the video till the end. And if this works for you, do not forget to like and subscribe. So basically what happened that whenever you try to download the kernel and install it, you get an error message while installing that says could not connect to the server try using a vpn right and many people even reported that uh, while downloading this they are not able to get the option of installing so how you have to fix any related problem related to kernel on your windows 10 and windows 11. So what you need to do first you need to disable the security from your windows and from your chrome browser so on your windows 10 or 11 click on the search box type here virus then click virus and threat protection now here click on manage settings under virus and threat protection settings disable real-time protection cloud delivered protection automatic sample submission tamper protection this will be disabled for a while then from the left hand menu option click on firewall and network protection then click domain network and disable defender firewall click on yes now you have to close it now open your chrome browser click on the three dot that is on the right hand top then click on settings now from the left hand menu option click on privacy and security and here you will get the option of security click on security so now this safe browsing should be set to either enhanced protection or standard protection you have to go with the third option that says no protection choose this option click on turn off and then you have to close your chrome browser and then you have to reopen it once opened again you have to open the kernel website then click on download then click on the latest version download kernel now you will be getting this option block dangerous but after disabling the security you will be also getting this option of keep okay so you have to click on keep and once it's been downloaded you have to open the folder make sure now you don't have to install it you just need to open the folder where it's been showing the downloaded file okay so next you need to enable the vpn on your windows pc and laptop okay so don't go with any kind of extension vpn extension the one that i would recommend you that you should go with proton vpn that's absolutely free and that will be surely doing your job okay so i will leave a link in the description you can come to this proton website you can just sign up and download this application vpn for free okay so once you have downloaded you have to open your vpn and then you have to connect to some different location okay so wherever it's not uh, blocked you have to go with that location like say i will go with netherland okay so i will click on connect and wait until the connection has been done and i have been assigned with a new ip from netherland all right so now it's been connected i can minimize it and again open the folder where my kernel has been downloaded now you have to click on the kernel beta and you will see now there won't be any kind of error message and it's been successfully downloaded and now coming up now you can run any kind of script that you want and after this what you can try you can again go back to your security and just re-enable them again so go to manage setting just enable all the security from here whichever you disable and also the chrome security that was being set to safe browsing enhanced protection you can also enable that back Hopefully guys this will work for you and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe for any question let me know in the comment section till then take care bye bye